Hey, YouTube family, what's up? This your boy, Ray Mack. I got another, another good recipe for you guys. This is that four-pack potato. You can cook this on the grill, or you can cook this in the stove or in the oven. I guarantee you it's going to work out. These are the ingredients. I got some potatoes that I just cut up for you, along with some tricolor bell peppers and some onions. So, with this here, I'm also going to take some of this here Kerrygold butter. This is that garlic and herb butter, along with some kosher salt, and I have some garlic pepper seasoning, along with some Cajun seasoning. I'm going to tell you something right now. With all of these combinations of flavor, it's going to work out fine. I'm telling you, you, you can't go wrong with this recipe. Now, I want you to take at least two sheets of heavy-duty aluminum foil and just spread it out on the table. All right, then I want you to take all of your veggies along with the potatoes. You could use any kind of potatoes you like and then take your tricolor bell peppers and cut these up into strips. And I want you to take you some onions and cut them up into strips as well and just place it on top of your doubled foil paper. I'm sorry, your doubled foil aluminum foil, all right? And um, from there, I'm going to tell you the next step. So don't go nowhere because if you do, you're definitely going to miss something good. And I don't want you to miss nothing good. Trust me. Now what I want you to do is just go ahead and add your seasonings to this. So I got that garlic um, pepper seasoning that I just put down. And I'm also going to take some of this here Cajun seasoning and I just want to sprinkle it all up. As you can see, I'm not measuring anything, okay? So I want you to go ahead and let the ancestors guide you. I do not have measurements for these ingredients. You cannot go wrong once you do this recipe. So I'm also tossing in um, the kosher salt with this. And um, with that, I want to give everything a nice mix. Just toss all of these vegetables together and make sure that the seasoning is basically getting um, placed on all sides of this thing. So now the next thing I want to do, all right, I want to take that Kerrygold butter, this garlic and herb butter, and I want to go ahead and start cutting this baby up into nice little slices, right? And place this all over the potatoes. Now, what I want you to do is not cut them up into one tablespoon cubes. I want you to go and cut them up a little bit here and a little bit there and just spread it right on top of your vegetables. All right, get an even coating of your butter. So go ahead and do that right now and then we're gonna go ahead and go to the next step, all right? Now I want you to take at least two more sheets of this heavy duty aluminum foil and place it right on top of your veggies and just form a pocket um, for this, all right? Form you a nice little pocket for this. And what I normally do is I fold up the long end first, tuck them all together. And then from there, I bring in the sides and give this a nice little pocket. And I can slip it on the grill or I can slip it in the oven, however you want. If you're gonna use the oven for this here recipe, set your temperature at 375 degrees and let it cook for at least around about a good 35 um, to 40 minutes. I guarantee you, you're gonna love it. If you're gonna cook this on the grill, go ahead and set your temperature to at least 350 degrees or 375 degrees and just let this baby roll until um, for the same amount of minutes, from 35 to 40 minutes. I guarantee you all of these flavors will marry together and that butter is just gonna, mm, I, I don't even know why I'm talking to y'all. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and throw it on the grill. And I do have some chicken and some sausage. That sausage I want to put on top of these potatoes once they're done. But I want the sausage to get a nice little char on them. Now, since we've finished the cooking process, I want to open up this foil pack and be careful when you open it up because I don't want you to burn yourself. You understand what I'm saying? But when you open up this foil pack, that aroma is going to hit your nose so hard. I mean, it's going to perme permeate the, the atmosphere. 
And then I want you to take your fork to see how tender these potatoes are. I'm telling you, y'all, these are definitely some good potatoes that you will love and enjoy. This is the ultimate side dish for any cookout. Not just the cookout, but for any Sunday dinner, or you could just have this for dinner all by itself. Just take you some smoked sausages and add it to the foil pack and cook it. Or you could take you some steak cubes, add it to it, and just cook it. Or you could take you some shrimp. I don't care what the protein is. Try it, and I guarantee you, you will love it. Now, with that being said, I want you to do me a favor if you guys don't mind, all right? I want you to go ahead and subscribe to this here channel. Once you subscribe to this channel, hit that thumbs up button. And then on top of that, hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified of all the upcoming videos for Ray Max Kitchen and Grill. Hit that subscribe button, y'all. Become a Ray Max family member. And if you subscribe, let me know that you did subscribe so I could um, come back, comment and say thank you. So love and not hate. Love somebody and hate nobody. Peace.